Why is sleep so important? Sleep is a basic human need and is critical to physical and psychological health and helping your brain to function properly. While individuals vary, most adults need seven to nine hours of sleep per night. Sleep needs vary by age, with children requiring 12 to 14 hours of sleep per day. Many of us do not get enough sleep. In fact, one out of every three American adults do not get the recommended amount, and 34% rate their sleep as poor or only fair. 50 million Americans have chronic sleep disorders. Sleep disorders involve problems with the quality, timing, and amount of sleep that cause distress and trouble at work, school, or other areas of your life. The most common sleep disorder is insomnia. Insomnia is when someone has difficulty getting to sleep or staying asleep for at least three nights a week for at least three months. Or it is a cause of significant distress or impaired daytime functioning in their daily routine. Other sleep disorders include obstructive sleep apnea, narcolepsy, and restless leg syndrome. Sleeping creates a continuous and reinforcing cycle of positive health. A disruption in this cycle can make underlying medical and mental health conditions, like depression, anxiety, or other disorders, much worse. At the same time, these underlying conditions can also be the cause of your lack of sleep. If not treated properly, sleep disorders can lead to serious health problems like heart disease, diabetes, and obesity. They can also cause emotional disorders, such as depression and anxiety. Rest easy, knowing that many sleep problems can be improved by sticking to a schedule and practicing sleep hygiene, such as allowing your body to wind down with a calming activity, such as reading away from bright lights and avoiding electronic devices before sleep, avoiding naps, especially in the afternoon, exercising daily, creating a quiet, cool, and dark bedroom environment, avoiding alcohol, caffeine, and heavy meals in the evening. Chronic sleep disorders like insomnia can be assessed through a medical history, a physical exam, a sleep diary, and clinical testing, such as a sleep study. They can be treated with a combination of behavioral techniques, such as cognitive behavioral therapy and sleep medications. Several types of medications can be used to treat insomnia and to help you fall asleep or stay asleep. Although, some of these can have side effects and can become habit-forming. Research has developed safer alternatives that can have significant positive impact on sleep and preserve daytime functioning. Treatments are also available for other sleep disorders. These include bright light therapy, circadian rhythm adjustments, upper airway surgery, oral appliances, upper airway pacing devices, among others. For more information, please visit www.psychiatry.org.